On June 18th, 2014, the Love and War update was released. With it, it gave us five things. An SFM video, taunts, achievements, weapons, and bread. Yes, you could play the line. Question. What's your question, soldier? I teleported bread. What? You told me to. How much? I have done nothing but teleport bread for three days. There! There, have you been sending it? However, why is this video focusing on bread? Well, I was watching the leaderboard of 107 facts of a team Fortress 2 when I had heard this line. There are nine different bread models in Team Fortress 2. I wonder if they correspond to the nine different classes. Which that had got me thinking. Do the bread correspond to the nine different classes? So, let's find out. So we all here know that there are 9 different classes in Team Fortress 2, and we also now know that there are 9 different bread types that come out the teleporter when you teleport in game. But how could these breads possibly relate to the 9 different classes? Well, let me begin and you'll slowly piece together how the breads relate. First and foremost, Le Baguette. This relates to the spy. Because the spy's origin is from France. And very conveniently, a baguette's origin is also from France. The pretzel relates to the medic since both originate from Germany. The pikelet, otherwise known as a crumpet, is related to the Delman since pikelets, or as they are actually called crumpets, originated from the UK but mostly were made in Scotland. The Burdunsky relates to the heavy since both of them are Russian. Well, that's four of the easy ones down. What we're left with is the five harder ones. Alas, let us begin. I might consider doing the easy one out of the five first. Texas Toast relates to the engineer, since both Texas Toast and the engineer come from Texas. Duh. Also, you could play the Tiny Desk Engineer thing if you want. <laughs> now here's where things get tricky. Adamana bread was created in the United States, but for all the information I checked, I could never find exactly where it was created in the United States. So this could either relate to the soldier or the scout. But on the flip side, cornbread was also made in America. In fact, on the wiki, it just simply says it was made by Americans. It has no place of origin for some reason. And so, yet again, that could either, either relate to the scout or the soldier. I am stuck. Because the cinnamon swell and the canned bread, I just don't have enough information to give a clear answer on who they could be. Cinnamon swell originated from... Switzerland. Canned bread, however, has no origin. I believe that the cinnamon swell is the pyro. Yes, I am saying that the pyro comes from Switzerland. And how the canned bread is obviously probably going to be the sniper. But let me tell you why. Canned bread, in my opinion, sounds like something that a camper would use to take on a trip and it would be easy to bring instead of having bread in a loaf being squashed. But I don't know. Tell me what you think. Please tell me down below what you think the cinnamon swell or the canned bread could be. But anyway, please like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.